Greetings and salutations, folks. My name is Nick, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Bloodlines, where um, apparently Maria is suspected to be an ally to myself and the Assassins, despite the fact that she is still technically a loyal Templar. Um, though the idea of Templars betraying their own people... Um, oh, sorry. I was looking down. I should be... Uh, looking up, um, is not terribly surprising, considering the fact that, uh, in one of the early cutscenes by itself, the lead Templar is all like, hey, guards, you can do whatever you want in search for, uh, for the killer of Frederick the Red. And then one of the guards is like, yeah, but won't that make people angry? And then he's like, I'm just gonna kill you. Because that's the one thing you can't do, is object with me. Oh no. Oh wait, did he just get... No, they're just getting punched. Excuse me. Oh my, that was a lot of Templar... Uh, bronze coins. That'll be very convenient in regards to upgrading my, uh, character. Nope. There we go. You know, I think that there's a, uh, thing at the top that says I have to defeat a certain amount of bad guys. But it's very bright, and it's against very bright scenery. Uh, there we go. Pirates defeated. 5 out of 10. Oh. There we go. Okay. Mm, my timing is not particularly good. There we... Alright. And then we can finish that guy off. And take care of this guy. All right. Have we done it? We have done it. Oh no, another guy shows up out of nowhere and dead in a cutscene. The pirates. They jumped us. It was all so sudden. Well, Maria, it seems there's a hefty price on both our heads. A price? Goddamn Bouchard. He probably thinks I'm your bloody apprentice. Someone Actually, he said consort. Search for us. The bull. So they gave that zealot his own parish. Is he a friend of yours? Hardly. His name is Moloch. He's a pious blowhard with arms like tree trunks. Do you know the resistance safe house in the commons? I know where it is, but I've never been inside. I'm just a foot soldier for the resistance. I can't be seen with Maria, so you'll have to take her. Keep her out of sight and meet me there when you're safe. I know some back alleys and tunnels. It may take longer, but we'll get her there in one piece. That's probably important. All right. All right. Uh, now I suppose let's go back to the safe house because there is a, this game has a lot of there and back again. Uh, go out and do... Well, I, I suppose you could say that's also an extension of Assassin's Creed 1. Don't try any you just said... You say don't try anything rash immediately after you stab me. Um, like Assassin's Creed 1 had a lot of... Nope of, uh, go out for the target, return to, uh, your hub, your base camp. 
um, go out to the target, return to your base camp. Uh, and this definitely feels like it's a lot of get quest, do quest, go back. So rude, these people. Uh, let's see if... Uh... Getting higher off the ground will help me out a little bit. Um, and yeah, so this game has a lot of that kind of repetition in order to kind of continue the plot. Uh, no, no, there. There's a ledge I can... There we go. I was going to say, there's a ledge I can walk on, but I can't seem to point myself at the ledge. And yes, it is easier to just walk off the side and fall than trying to drop down. I just got word that someone found poor Jonas's body. What a waste, eh? <laughs> you knew him better than me. I'm sure he understood the risk of playing both sides. Yes, unfortunately, this has complicated things. Jonas was a respected Cypriot, and his death has sparked riots near the old church. The public is hungry for revenge, and to quell this, the bull will call you out. You may lose the support of the resistance. One death is enough to spark a riot? <laughs> the bull has been a cruel master. And unlike the Templars, he actually believes what he preaches. He loathes our local church. How is that an answer to my my question? Set of historic scrolls from us, claiming they were symbols of pagan blasphemy. But Jonas was a traitor. Did the resistance not know? Not enough of them, I am afraid. The resistance is quite scattered. Well, you'll have the chance to tell them yourself. Some men are on their way here now. You are bringing people here? People you can trust? Kind of. I'm not sure who I can trust right now, but it's worth the risk. Right now, I have to stop these riots from spreading. I mean, I trust and one or two of them. Bargain, I will see what I can do about getting you close to Boshart. A deal is a deal, eh? All right. Stop the riot at the church in the Karina Common Grounds. Kill the fanatics attacking the church. All right. Uh, there. Oh, no. There we go. All right. Oh, we're already at the church. That was fast. Jonas was rash. And until I find out more about Barnabas, I won't be running any more of his errands. Now, time to quell these riots before the bull clamps down harder. A lot of people punching people in the gut. Alright, that's one. It feels like a, um... Like, when people kind of charge at you... They just kind of, like, run at you and immediately attack. As opposed to their... Nope. Don't have the timing. No, that's still too late. There we go. Sir, I was busy attacking somebody else. Uh, wait your turn. There are clearly more than six fanatics, so I guess I don't have to defeat them all.
Oh, kill the archers attacking the church before the church burns. Oh, is this going to be a timer? Is, is there going to be a timer based on this? That is my concern. Um, hmm. A minute and 56 seconds. Or two minutes, I guess. That's not terrible. It's not like that 30 second timer just to deliver a package. At least now you can say, oh, all right, I understand how things are at stake. Because, like, a building can only take so much fire before it burns down. Now, where is the remaining... No, point yourself at the... There we go. All right. All right. Two minutes was plenty of time. And return to the safe house again. Ah, damn it. How, how did you find me so easily? Is there a hiding spot up here, or... For me to become anonymous? There is. All right, let us turn in this quest having neutralized these fanatics. Um, probably going to fight the bull after this, I would imagine. What's going on out there? The city is in turmoil. I've seen riots. The people are protesting the death of a citizen, a man named Jonas. Have you heard of him? My father knew him well. He was a good man. How did he die? I killed him. Bravely. Listen, Marcos, things have gotten complicated. Before I find Bouchard, I need to eliminate the bull and put an end to his violence. You have quite a taste for chaos, Altair. The bull is one man responsible for the subjugation of thousands. Few will mourn his loss. I mean, both of these statements could be true. Kantara, sting him and exit unnoticed? He surrounds himself with devoted worshippers. Kantara, that's to the east? Yes. It's the most well defended. Forget it. You'll see. All right. Assassinate Moloch the Bull. Memory log updated. All right. At the very least, people aren't going to start attacking me now. Now that I've turned in the quest, people aren't going to start. Um, or they are going to start attacking me just because I'm walking by. Possibly as a result of the... Ow. Nope, I'm just leaving. Screw you guys. I'm going home. Ah. Thank you, cutscene, for enabling myself to just climb over the side of this scale unscalable wall. Alright, what am I looking at? So I need to go around this courtyard. Damn it! The cutscene made him unkillable. Ah, uh, a good old, uh, Prince of Persia cutscene. I want to say Prince of Persia was, is like the earliest example of this kind of thing. Where, um, like the camera just kind of like zooms across the level and shows you, uh, the path. Oh, 
Hold on. A silver Templar coin. Fantastic. Hello, Archer. And then I go around the top here. Don't fall off the side. Because that sounds like a better... No, no, no. <clears throat> strategy than falling would be. And then I can climb around these guards, I presume. Thank you, game, for giving me a clear path without any trouble. Without any... With, with some trouble. Another silver Templar coin. I don't know what they're used for yet, but... Ah, can I just sit inside this haystack and uh, become anonymous? I can. Um, there was a guy there, but I guess he left us. And now... Nope, that is not the entrance to the next area. That's just a... Just a doorway. Excuse me, sir. I hope you enjoyed the view. And you, sir, can also be stabbed. Ah, now I can actually go to a different area. Hmm. I wonder if it's saying that I can actually jump onto... Or do I just... Hmm. It doesn't seem like I can. Of course, I suppose this way also works. Not exactly the most elegant. Hmm. Uh, manner, but it gets the job done. Although it would be nice if Altair actually took out his sword a little bit faster. Like, everything does feel very slow and sluggish. More so than the original. But again, I'm playing this on the PSP. Uh, it's, it's not a 360 game, so some caveats in regards to processor speed and... Oh, oh hello.
Might as well just keep my sword out at this point, really. Oh. A lot, a little bit more lead up for this specific boss. Although, is this uh, because this boss is going to be something different, or is, or is this just uh, them trying to advance the gameplay? Like the boss himself is just going to be ordinary. Sometimes it's hard to tell because, like Assassin's Creed One, did have a lot of uh, like variation to its uh, enemies too. Including enemies that set traps for Altair. That was very slow motion jump through the air. Running over all the way over here. Hit me. I'm trying. Can I, uh, can I counter that attack? Don't know. Definitely takes a lot of hits. Does God fill your heart with fear? No. Does God fill your heart with fear? You're just kind of like being a terrible person, so clearly not. Okay, slow and steady, but my health regeneration seems strong enough that, uh, yeah, it was able me to outlast. You know, like, what do these... Like, what do these soldiers actually expect to do? Like, if Moloch is probably the toughest guy in this place, like, what do they expect to accomplish after I've killed Moloch? Like, they can s clearly see his dead body on the floor. Sorry, gotta go. How did you know? <laughs> How did you find me so easily? Serpentine. Serpentine. I hope neither, none of those uh, guys land in a haystack. Otherwise, I'll be landing on a haystack with somebody in it. Also, would the Templars eventually at some point realize that assassins keep jumping into haystacks? And be like, hey, uh, guys, we're gonna have to keep haystacks away from our tallest towers. Um, no haystacks allowed within the city limits. Ah, 
All right. We have killed the bull. Made a whole bunch of enemies. As per as par for the course. Why do our instincts insist on violence? I have studied the interactions between different species. The innate desire to survive seems to demand the death of the other. Why can they not stand hand in hand? So many believe the world was created through the works of a divine power. But I see only the designs of a madman bent on celebrating death, destruction, and desperation. All right. Um. Let us increase our synchronization rate. That way we can heal faster. So now we finish the first two sequences. Uh, three more to go. Until the final fight. Altair, we were attacked. We tried to fight them off, but it was no use. Did they take Maria? I think so. They took everyone else. I wanted to stop them. You but think so? I had to hide. You can look in the empty end. cell and know. This was not your fault. The Templars are crafty. I've heard they harness the powers of a dark oracle in Buffavento. That must Buff be Buffavento? That's a curious theory, but I suspect it was Barnabas who tipped them off. Barnabas? How can that be? The resistance leader Barnabas was executed the day before you arrived. Before I arrived? Altair. The Templars are preparing to execute our men. You must stop them. Hmm. Stop the execution in the Karina market. Seems important. Let us go there with haste. So if they executed him before Altair showed up, I suppose this presumes that the traitor would have to be somebody else. Either way, it looks as though I have not actually been in this area, uh, as there is a viewpoint for me to go to. Um. How do I get out of here? <laughs> nah. Hey, move it. Why don't you watch where you go? There we go. Escape is mine. Uh, let's see if we can climb this up first. Unlock, synchronize the viewpoint, and then... N no, no. Uh, I'm guessing uh, that is an area for me to... Whether that's an area that's blocked off for memory reasons, or whether that's a area that is... Basically, like, that entire mission occupies that block. Either way, let us synchronize and look at this wonderful, grayish... ...washed-out area.
Nice. Assassin. There's an assassin here. How did you know? And then kill that guy. Um, camera. The camera wasn't particularly interested in actually showing the action this time. Maybe next time. Um, Altair, your sp your spinning move is not particularly effective at killing people. It just kind of shifts them around you. See, that's more effective. At least you can knock them knock them down. Is it? Um. Oh wait, is he? What's got into him? Where is? Oh, there he is. There we go. He is done. I mean, I suppose I could probably try running at this point. Nope. Not into this haystack. Even though it's relatively conveniently placed for reasons. It seems as though the marketplace is mostly haystacks. Just stacks and stacks of hay everywhere. As far as the eye can see. No. I guess slightly to the right. There we go. No one will find me here. Excellent. Nope. There we go. All right. What has freeing the prisoners done? I wasn't able to locate all of your men, Marcos. They may still be imprisoned, either at the harbor jail or in Buffavento. It would help to narrow that down. We don't have much time. There's the two locations, so. Sorrows in the harbor district after a day's work. You may be able to find information there. I mean, I could just Still hit up both places. None. You think maybe she misses your company? She might after she learns more about her old friends. Meet me later, outside the gates to Buvavento. All right. Um, I think I'm going to stop here for the night. Got any suggestions for someone to play next? Leave them down in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have yourselves... A good night.